so let's get started. Oh my god, I cannot fucking believe what is happening right now. Like, are, are you serious? I, I just, I, I don't understand, like, what the fuck is going on. I mean, can someone please explain to me why, why did he get fired? Like, what was the reason? And, and I, I don't want to hear the excuses because of, of budget cuts, like, bullshit. That was not, that was not the real reason. No, I, I, I kind of. I kind of have, a, like, a theory about that. I, I kind of feel that they want Alexa Bliss to have that character and kind of carry that on. Um, you know, because they didn't know what else to do with, you know, with uh, with the Fiend Bray Wyatt. So because of that, um, you know, they kind of, like, slowly were, I guess, uh, transitioning to put it on, on, on Alexa Bliss and to have, have her kind of, uh, kind of carry that through. And, um, I don't know, I just don't think they really had any plans for, uh, you know, for him, uh, you know, after, uh, after WrestleMania, you know, like, like, this man has been gone since, like, fucking, what, like, April, so, I mean, that, that's just really tragic to me, and I, I just, like, I, I will never understand WWE's policies, or, or, or really, or, or anything, uh, like that, I'm, I'm just, I'm so saddened by this. I, I'm just like pissed off, so I'm sorry if I'm at a loss for words. I just it's it's kind of hard to really talk about because I thought that he was like really uh just a a creative person and just and just a a, a decent human being like like off, like off camera. He's just the, like the nicest person. So I'm not really sure exactly what why he got why he got fired. Um, you know, I just, like I said, I just think that, that, you know, that Vince, Vince and Bruce, I don't think they really saw anything in him, because if they did, then they would have, uh, you know, I don't think they would have given the character to, to Alexa, I, I, I think, I think we have to get that, get that out of the way, I, I don't think Alexa Bliss would even have this, uh, this, like, knockoff, uh, fucking character that she has right now, um, you know, I, I think if they really, if they really had any, any belief in, in, in Bray Wyatt and the Fiend character, then, then he, you know, he would be, he would be winning more, you know, he would have won, uh, uh, that match, uh, against Randy Orton, you know, that, you know, there was no reason why, why he had to lose to, to Randy at, at Mania, there was, like, no reason for that, so I, you know, you know, but then again, there, there was no fucking reason that, uh, that he had to lose against, against fucking, uh, uh, you know, old Oldberg, you know, I, I feel that, uh, I feel that Oldberg, Goldberg should have, I uh, should have put the fiend over in, in the, in the first place, that was kind of the ultimate burial, and in, in my opinion, that was when the burial of the fiend actually, you know, kind of really started, so, but he's definitely fucking buried now, so, yeah, thank you so much, WWE, this company fucking sucks, I, I just, I just cannot believe it, um, I mean, he, he had really good, good ideas, it was just like, Vince, Vince didn't really give a shit about them, and that's, that's the saddest thing of, of everything, just of them all, the, the saddest part about this is, is that, like, is, is that, you know, you're only making it, you know, AEW look more and more kind of powerful, yeah, Vince does know that, right, I think, I think with him lying and saying, uh, in that conference call, a little, like, uh, that meeting or whatever with the, uh, with some of the, people, you know, I didn't mean the little, the stock, whatever the fuck you want to call it, the, the B, B4 meeting, whatever the hell it's called, he was saying that AEW is not competition, which I find that kind of laughable, uh, because in a way, AEW is WWE's competition, no matter how, how, how you want to look at it, and, and please stop saying it's WCW light, it's not, they're, like, they're, they're a lot different than, than that, they're, they're way more successful than WCW, you know, ever was, so let's just get that shit out the way. Um, and second of all, I, I I don't really see the Alexa Bliss thing kind of being a, a thing for for that much much longer. If I'm being honest with you, because now that that Bray is gone, uh, like I, I feel that Bliss is gonna have to to turn face at some point. And not unless she's gonna have like a, a Batman or Robin scenario with uh with her former friend, um you know almost superhero. Or, or, or ASS, what, ASH, 
whatever she wants to be called. Uh, Nikki Ass, I, I don't know. Ash, Ash, Ash Hole, I, I don't know. But if they're gonna do something uh, like that, I can see that, and then, and then just, and then you're gonna have to end it after that. You know, if you're gonna have a storyline, uh, you know, with, um, with that kind of scenario, then uh, you're gonna have to have, to have, you're gonna have to have Nikki go over at some point or whatever. So, uh, sorry, I just cannot believe this is fucking happening. I, I'm just so, I'm just so mad right now. I'm like, holy shit. Oh god, this company is fucking terrible. just kind of stumbling over like what to say right now because it's just really frustrating I, w- I want to root for WWE so bad but it's like I can't you know like they're like they're, they're giving like like free talent away like what the fuck what the fuck are you doing Vince like, like what, what is going on I mean am I the only one that that, not- that is noticing this uh, it's just it's just crazy to me. Like, your bitches is crazy over there in WWE. Like, what the fuck are you doing? Like, seriously. You're giving talent away to AEW. You're making, you're making them bigger. You're making that brand bigger. Like, oh, what the actual fuck? Like, are you serious? Yeah, so, you know what? Um, I, I, I'm going to have to stop, stop, you know, kind of. Get, getting behind WWE, I'm just gonna have to watch them maybe like in, in an ironic way now, because like I can't I can't take this fucking company you know seriously anymore. I'm so sorry, but um, but yeah, I mean it's it's you know, I mean like you already let Daniel Bryan go, you letting the Fiend go too, uh, yeah yeah fuck fuck all the way off of WWE. Um, yeah, it's just really really strange to me. I. I don't know what's what's going on over there. Like, Vince is old, old decrepit, uh, like a t- tired ass fuck. You know, uh, you know that that does doesn't know uh, doesn't know shit anymore. It does not know how how to run a, a fucking wrestling company. It, it, no anymore. He's fucking garbage. He's trash now. So yeah, yeah yes, yeah. Like get get rid of him. You know. Like get rid of this fucking guy. Like he's old, he needs to go to to the retirement home right along with the with the Goldberg's old ass. Like take both of them to the retirement community. Bye. Like send these bitches packing, and then let's the, you know let's get somebody younger and more, you know and you know and, and more popping, um, you know up up in this bitch, and you know make make WWE you know an actual, you know like to be number one again because I mean. They they're not they not doing shit right now. They're not doing it for me at at this time. I don't know. I'm I'm just shocked. I wish I wish Bray Wyatt nothing but the best. Uh, you know I really do. Uh, uh, please Tony Khan, please sign him. Thank you. Like, comment, and subscribe. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.